I'd done two tours and I felt guilty for not having done more. Um, I felt, uh, you know, I, I felt that nothing was ever going to be better, that I was always going to feel this way and uh, I was always going to feel angry, I was always going to feel bad. I felt like there was no hope for me. I, um, Growing up, I'd been very religious. Uh, when I joined the military, I was very religious. I felt God gave up on me. Uh, you know, one day, after a really bad day once, I, uh, after a really bad day, I, I, I literally cursed God. Man. And, and it was something that I was brought up not to do. That was a bad day. Um, you know, I sat down, I, I, I just told, I, I, I was, you know, I told God, I was like, just let me die. Just, I, I'm not gonna, just just kill me. Um, it was bad. Finally, it, and I have no clue exactly how or why it clicked, um, but one day I just sort of woke up, I was like, I don't have to feel like this. And um, so I, you know, I, I started going back to church. Um, I talked with, uh, I talked with the bishop of my church and we, we started working through a few things, and he suggested I go see somebody. He was a psychiatrist uh, that went to the same church I did because I, um, I was single. I was going to a singles congregation. Um, he, uh, he was very understanding. Um, he helped bring some religious end of it, which brought me some healing, I felt. And then he was able to explain some of the some of the brain chemistry behind why I was feeling and some of the um, some of the way my brain was working as to what what I was experiencing when I was feeling um, and that that brought a huge amount of relief 